here. Mm. Hang on, let me just let me just prop it up so quickly. So I am about to go to the midwife for my 38 week appointment. So we're gonna have a quick update when we get back. But I just thought I'd start this video now because hopefully what I'm hoping for is for her to be fully engaged today, the baby, not my midwife. Um, and that there's some sort of like progress happening in terms of like being close to labor maybe. I'm not too sure like how it works like if she's gonna check me or whatever, or if that doesn't happen to like 40 weeks, if I even make it to 40 weeks. But hopefully the update will be that things have moved forward potentially for my last midwife appointment, um, which she was kind of, she was engaging, but she wasn't fully engaged because if you don't know, babies kind of have to go like, they engage a couple of times before they fully engage. So hopefully, we've got good news after this midwife appointment because hopefully she will be here soon and yeah i will i'm going to leave now and i will be back and i will update you then i am back hello so kind of eventful well i say eventful it's not really eventful i have been sent for a scan on friday today is wednesday i've been sent for a scan on friday because i have grown apparently my bump has grown a little bit too well two inches too much which could mean i have too much fluids in my placenta or it could mean that the baby's grown a bit too much I've, it's, I think it's just like a little checkup scan just to see how she's doing, see if she's in like an okay environment kind of thing. I'm not really too sure. But if it does mean, worst case scenario, or really that it is, is if I have too much fluids, they might have to induce me a little bit early. Um, I don't know how much earlier. I don't know if it will be kind of like early next week I could get induced or like maybe like on my due date I'm not I'm not entirely sure but I could get induced early if that's really a worst case scenario which isn't really like a worst like a s bad scenario to be in because it's not like she's not unhealthy like she's in no way unhealthy it's just what's going on in the in the placenta really but she's four fifths engaged so she's pretty much there. She's pretty much ready to go in that sense. Because um, apparently they measure it in like four fifths. Um, I'm not really sure. I'm not a midwife. I don't know um, what that means. But she said that that's absolutely perfect. Um, 38 weeks. So hopefully things are looking good if the scan is just a bit of a fluke. I'm kind of nervous for to have a scan Friday. But... I am kind of excited because I can't wait to see her. See my little bean. My heartbeat was perfect as well. My blood pressure was perfect. Everything is pretty much where it needs to be. Just my bump is grown a little bit too much, which I find crazy because I have, like when I look at myself, we'll do a bump date in a minute. When I look at myself, I just don't feel like I've grown as much as I have potentially. So yeah. We could have a baby next week, everyone. We could, don't know. I could go into labor naturally before, <laughs> anyway, but ooh. we've just got to see what happens. So Friday will be a vlog of, hopefully I'll be able to film in there. I'm gonna ask to film in there because Charlie won't be able to come because he's at work. I'm just very skeptical for what Friday's gonna bring. Um, I don't think I have to get induced. I'm kind of waffling now, aren't I? But yeah, that's the tea. That is the tea on my midwife appointment. Not a lot. Well, it is a lot. I have got to go for a scan. Um, but yeah, I'll show you my bump. We'll see what's good. And then that will be it for this video. This is my bump at the minute. 38 weeks. 
I don't think I'm too big. Like, I haven't got any stretch marks or anything because I'm naturally kind of small anyway. So I think if I was to be absolutely huge, I don't know. Like, I think I'm kind of in proportion to myself. I'm not really too sure, to be honest. What does everyone else think? This is a me bump. So everyone, I have decided to make my midwife video into a bit of a vlog going up today, purely because today is Friday, I need a video for today, and instead of just uploading the midwife appointment video on its own, I thought I'd do the scan in with it and make it a bit of a vlog. So today is Friday, as I said, I've got my scan at 1.30, um, so I will take you along with me. Hopefully I'll maybe be able to film in there. I'm not too sure how it works, if I'm able to. I don't think I was last time, but either way, I will give you the down low of what happens after. Um, so yeah, um, I'm quite, I'm quite excited because I get to see my little bubba again, but I'm quite... I don't think I have to get induced, honestly. I don't think, I think that's kind of like the worst case scenario I'll have to get induced. However, it would be kind of nice because I get to have my baby, but it's very well known. Your labor is a lot more intense. And to be honest with you, I don't really want that. So I'm not really doing anything now. I might make some pancakes. I'm a bit peckish, even though I just had breakfast, but it was tiny. Well, it's 11 o'clock now. I'm just gonna chill for a bit. I just filmed a video which will be going up whenever, well, I have my curly hair, so you'll know when what video it is. It's like looking back over my pregnancy and um, I gave like a couple of tips about being like a pregnant teen, really. I basically just chatted shit for about 20 minutes. So good luck listening to that one when it's up because I don't think it's gonna be very good. To update you when I'm about to go to the hospital to get my scan. So, peace. Hi guys, so basically I'm back from my scan. For some reason the clip that I filmed won't work for some reason while I'm editing. So I'm just gonna do it on here. So sorry for the crap quality. Um, but basically everything went absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. I think it all comes down really to human error when she was like measuring my belly or something or it could have been like just like a little growth spurt like because I've been quite reasonably small um, throughout the pregnancy so it might just be like a little growth spurt and I'm just bigger than I usually really should be but it's nothing to worry about she's absolutely fine the fluids are the right amount so I don't have to get induced which I'm kind of relieved about um, but yeah, so it's just now a matter of waiting when she's going to be here. So yeah, everything went perfect. So please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more from me over Vlogmas because hopefully the bubble will be here soon. Hopefully, fingers crossed. But yeah, thank you very much for watching and I will see you tomorrow in tomorrow's video.